Hi everyone, welcome back. Today's video is about the primary structure of proteins. Before we get to the video, please make sure to subscribe to our channel as this helps us out a lot. Okay, let's get to the video. Proteins are complex macromolecules made up of amino acids. Their structure can be described at different levels. The different levels include the primary, secondary, tertiary, and quaternary structures. Let's consider each in more detail. Primary structure. The primary structure of proteins refer to the linear sequence of amino acids in polypeptide chains. It is the most basic level of protein structure. The primary structure is essentially a list of amino acids linked together in a specific order. This order is determined by the genetic material of an organism. This may be DNA or RNA. The genetic code determines the sequence of amino acids in a protein. Therefore, any changes in the DNA sequence can result in a different amino acid being incorporated into the protein. This affects its structure and function. Refer to transcription and translation to learn more about the process of how DNA or RNA genetic material is used to make a protein. The primary sequence that is created is unique to that specific protein. There are 20 different amino acids commonly found in proteins. These amino acids are the building blocks that make the primary structure of polypeptide chains. They are linked together by peptide bonds. Peptide bonds are covalent bonds. They link the amino group of one amino acid to the carboxyl group of the adjacent amino acid. The sequence of amino acids is written from the N-terminus to the C-terminus. This sequence is critical because it dictates how the protein will fold into higher order structures and ultimately determine function. And that concludes this video. I hope this video was helpful for you. If it was, please make sure to like and subscribe to the channel. See you in the next video. Bye!